What's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna basically tell you how to fix every kind of crashing, freezing or lagging issue you're currently having with Titanfall 2. So stick to the end guys, this will be a step by step tutorial. In the end you will probably know what to do in order to fix this kind of issue. Before we start right into the video, I just want to you guys know, let you guys know that, that I would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, a comment or a subscription right into my YouTube channel, it would really make my day and help me out as a little YouTuber as I am. Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys, you would support my work on YouTube a little bit and I'm gonna really really be thankful for that and I'm gonna thank you for that. So anyways, I would just say, let's get right started. So the first step in order to fix this kind of issue is gonna be to open up your task manager by simply navigating down to your, to your taskbar, right click it and opening up your task manager. Once your task manager pops up, I want you to simply navigate to the top left corner just to ensure that you're sticking around processes, just click it. And afterwards, it's gonna sound weird guys, I know, but I just trust me, do that. I want you to simply end every single task, which has obviously nothing to do with Windows, by just simply right clicking it and clicking on to end the task. Let me explain why. Two reasons for that. So first of all, too many ap applications, programs, background processes, whatever, running in the background at the same time on a low end or bad PC will cause your game to crash, to freeze or to lag in some way. And by just ending those tasks, you're avoiding this issue. And the second thing is, like it was for me, there are some applications or programs which are currently third party in your game. Don't ask me why, but it's happening, causing it to crash or to freeze. So just again, by just simply ending every single task, you're avoiding this issue. Once you're finished, you should be able to enter task manager again. And the next step is gonna be to search an empty spot right on your desktop, right click it, Hit display settings, navigate to the top left corner just to ensure that you're sticking around display and identify which your main monitor is and obviously this just applies if you have more than one monitor. Once you identified it, scroll down, hit scale and layout and go to change the size of text apps and other items to 100% as recommended and the display resolution should be the same as in-game. So for example, if you have in-game 1720 by 1070, you also want to, to apply this to your display resolution. Once you're finished, I want you to end this task and navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen, opening up your settings, navigate into update and security, and sticking around Windows Update. And I know guys, it's gonna sound a little basic, but trust me, updating every single driver you could possibly update on your PC will help you a lot with every kind of issue you're currently having, and also with crashing, lagging, and freezing. So first of all, you just need to download the latest version of Windows by just simply clicking on to check for updates. Next step is going to be to end this task and do the same thing for your graphics card. So if you have AMD or Nvidia, it doesn't really matter. Just go to your application, go to the browser and download the latest version of that just to pr provide the best possible performance for your PC in general. That's it for the video. I hope that I could actually help you out of this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. I'm going to really be thankful for that. And I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but I'm just going to do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.